I've let the time slip up on me. That's the 12.15. The 12.15! Mr. Gomer Sykes, the station master, had joined the spectators gathered to survey the damage done to the Bison Gap's sheriff's office. But the sound of the approaching train snapped him back into line. Hurrying toward the bridge over the creek as fast as a man of his considerable bulk could manage, Station Master Sykes was usually on hand to receive the mailbags, as well as any important passengers. And since the railroad tracks ran behind the stores on Main Street, he had a good little run to reach the station. Sykes made it to the platform mere seconds before the train ground to a stop at the station. Oh boy. Ooh. Here she is. The 12. 15. Henry? Assistant Station Master Henry Peacock jumped into action and ran back to the mail car to swap mail bags with the train's mail clerk. Another employee set up the ramp for the lone arriving passenger to lead a solid white horse out of the stock car. Gomer Sykes took special notice of the man leading the horse. Tall and slender, he looked around him as if deciding whether or not the little town was worth his appearance. With thick black hair and a neatly trimmed mustache, he looked the part of a professional gambler, but the fancy black engraved gun belt suggested he might be proficient in something other than a game of cards. Seeing Sykes standing on the platform, the stranger led his horse up even with him and stopped. Afternoon. Afternoon. Welcome to Bison Gap. You looking for the Buffalo Hump Saloon? Now, what makes you think that? Oh, uh, I, I just thought you might be looking for some refreshment since you've been riding in the cattle car on such a warm day. This is my first time in Bison Gap, and I was going to ask you how to find the hotel. I assume there's a town over that way somewhere. He nodded toward the train, blocking his view of the town. Oh, yes, sir, there is. The Bison House Hotel. The hotel! I say, the Bison House Hotel is right over there. You'll see it as soon as the train pulls out of the way. Beautiful. Good food just built this year. It's operated by two women, the hotel and the dining room. I'm Gomer Sykes, the station master. Thank you, Gomer. The stranger stepped up into the saddle. Perhaps the saloon first. A drink before supper might be good at that. He turned the white gelding and crossed over the tracks vacated by the departing train. <laughs> 